Just aim left though, because you've missed right both times. So just correct in. Okay. <laughs> what is happening everybody? And welcome back to our channel. Exciting news for you today. Janice is back behind the mic and the camera. <laughs> we both have mics on. Yeah, so, we do. Hoping, crossing our fingers, you can hear both of us. We're trying this out new. If this doesn't work, Road, I'm calling you out. You have faulty products. Because we tried this once before and it didn't work that well. We'll see. But we're going to play some uh, disc golf. Janice hasn't played in a while. Yep, so and don't uh, me throwing. I think everyone wants to see you throw. So here we go, hole one, 396. It's a little windy out here. Basket's behind that tree. And it's been a while since I filmed too, so let's see if I can get this uh, this footage going. Oh, oh! Don't blame whatever was on the tee. No, 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 no! I wasn't blaming anything. That was a bad shot. Are you gonna throw another one? No, I'm gonna throw one more. Second one's always the best. That's a putt. Huh? Joe Jennings. All right, Janice, people want to see what you got. Oh, here we go. Haven't uh, thrown a disc in. When's the last time I threw? I don't know, but was I. Was it my tournament? It might have been. I get a lot of people that ask when your next tournament is, how your game's going. <laughs> and I, I have to tell them, unfortunately, they're sad, but I have yeah. to tell them, I'm like, the last time you seen Janice throw a disc, wait, you're gonna throw the one that you, a brand new one? Yeah, you told me you wanted to see me throw this All one. All right, backhand. I mean, it's not like it's gonna be spectacular. What is it? It's a... It's a heat. It's an X heat, I think. What's the weight on it? Uh, Super light. 151, here we go. Oh boy. So you should be ready and prime for just an absolute launch job. Yeah. Up and over. All right, go back to the thrasher. Wow. That was a good try. It's it's in a tailwind. It was a little nose up too. I mean, honestly, my backhand wasn't my best anyway. Yeah. You were, so. let's be real, you were a forehand dominant player. So I'm just going to forehand this. Yeah. Don't like throw your arm out though. Did you loosen up at all? Okay, great. Do -si do. Oh man, she still got it. That thrasher, baby. Still has a cannon. <laughs> Janice absolutely smoked her tee shot. Just absolutely framed up perfectly. I think I'm going to zone it up, but I got this bad boy. Oh, new zone in the bag? New zone in the bag because someone stole my Get Freaky Party time. Yeah, let's see the color on that little swirl action. Hard to see in the sun, but. Someone stole my Get Freaky Party time. Uh. Did something with it. Wow. Well, I'm well. not quite sure who that was, though. I'm not either. What the heck? All right. What are you trying to do here? Go to the basket. Okay, good plan. Like that. We'll see how good your putt is. Yeah. <laughs> When's the last time you had a garage putt? It's been a while. In the mud pit 5,000? Yeah, I'm glad I didn't land in that. This buzz was freaking cash. Oh my gosh, I forgot how nice it is to put on Mach X baskets. Did I land in the muck? I don't know. Oh no, I'm right here. Are you going to putt from there too? Yeah, this was the this was my second one. Oh. A little right to left wind, going to lift it. Just got to bang it, ring it in there. Been having a lot of practice. Oh. Oh. A lot of practice putting in the wind lately. I don't know if I, you were too far on that one. Really? These is, see the audio on these things is supposed to go up to like 300 feet. Do we feel like these go up to 300 feet? No? What am I using to putt with? Uh oh. Did I grab a putter? Did you forget your putter? I think I did. Oh no, your trusty challengers? Looks what? like you're putting with a dark horse roach. You can grab that black one out of the basket and putt with it. This would be a massive putt back. Janice, all the people at home, it's going to go crazy in the comments if you make this. Janice is back! Oh boy. <laughs> Just a bit outside. Just going to clean that one up real quick. Should have put it with the zone. Should have, could have, would have. Like 
I said, it has been a hot minute. I did post a practice round at Dogwood, which was the last tournament I just played at, Texas State's Championship. If you haven't watched that video, go give it a watch because my goodness, what a course that place is. But now I'm preparing for my next couple tournaments. I just got done basically doing the Texas swing. <laughs> yeah. Allergies are kicking in now. Pollen is just flying around the world here. But yeah, the Texas swing is now done. And I have two tournaments coming up in a couple weeks. One in Arkansas, two, two in, in Arkansas, Arkansas actually. Uh, and those are supposedly supposed to be kind of bomber, big courses um, out in the wide open. So gonna be working on basically my shots, hyzers, all that fun stuff now that we're kind of getting out of the woods. But last five tournaments, I basically did five tournaments in a row. Um, I would say like B minus performance. There was a couple, Belton, I didn't play well. Um, and then there are a couple other tournaments that I feel like I made some mistakes that I wish I hadn't. So um, we'll see. We'll see if I can turn around coming up in this next stretch and uh, you did a good job. And, and make some moves. So hold to. Hold to. Okay, we're going to play the par four on this one. That's like really down and to the left. Uh, I'm going to bust out the new Dark Horse Force coming to a site near you soon. Oh, look at that. Would you look at that? I'm, I haven't thrown this yet. I'm kind of excited to see how this one rolls. It feels amazing. All right, so I'm just gonna pop this one out flat, slight hyzer, and then let this thing just take it left. Whoa. Kind of like that. I lost it. I lost it. I lost it. You need to throw one straight. You need to go thrasher and try to have it land by the pole. Orange pole. Yeah, that's what you. That's your game plan. Got it. Your game plan here is all about consistency and throwing straight shots. That's gonna be tough to find. They haven't cut the grass out here in a hot minute. And it's windy. Yeah. Well, I, that's not gonna make the disc finding the disc harder. It's gonna affect the flight. It's super windy though. What the heck is that? All right, you're in the fairway. What are you throwing? Thrasher again? No, no, no. All right, I got a towel for that. Don't throw that, throw your zone. Okay. Throw that dark horse zone. Man, it is windy out here, folks. Hopefully the audio is not too bad. <laughs> All right, so clearly there are some audio issues. If anyone has any idea why there's a choppiness, it's, it seems like it's only with Kelsey's mic. Are these road mics terrible? I don't know. Did okay. we get a faulty one? I'm not sure. We're going to go for this. You can try and make this? While the wind is like about to this, gust. This is the perfect time to make it. Oh my gosh. Uh oh. Frustration starts. <laughs> Dang it. All right, the windiest putt ever attempt. Windiest putt ever. I just tried to throw a forehand and just juice it in there. Uh oh boy. It's gonna be like a double bogey. <laughs> I don't even know how many strokes it is. Oh my god. So, when's your uh, next tournament gonna be, Janice? All right. All right, Brody found his disc for an eagle. For an eagle. Let's see. That's actually Crazy really right to left wind, so I just got to try to float this thing and let it glide in. That's a really good throw. Just let it play the glide factor, 5,000. Off into space and then let it glide. Let's see if he makes it. Like that? Oh, oh. my gosh. Dang. Is it too late say, if now I was, to say sorry? If I was one for one making eagles with this disc, this thing's going straight in my bag. It still might go straight into my bag. <laughs> but, all right, that worked, that worked out to perfection. I don't even know what I got on that hole. Uh, TBD. We were just talking off camera about how windy it is here in Texas. 
uh, and how I need to, at some point, move to a different location. Just because, you know, I gotta, I gotta get to a place where I can actually practice and not have it be Windfest 5000. Kelsey's got a couple more dark horse activities to do here in Texas, but let us know in the comments down below, what are the, some of the best places to move for disc golf? I know. And to also raise children okay, if we're to, moving there. Okay, raise children, sure, sure, sure. <laughs> I know. Oh yeah, sure. That thing, that I big milestone North, in our life. I know life. North Carolina's got some really sweet courses. I was looking at the Tampa area. It's got some sweet courses. We can't go West Coast, guys. No. Way too expensive. Yeah. We are not West Coast people. Yeah, so let us know in the comments, in. though, what are some cities or states that would be good places for us to potentially look at to move to? Yeah. In a couple of years. Not yet. A couple about, years. About three. What is this? Is this three hundo? Yeah. Three hundo? This is a get, free, uh, yeah, get freaky thought. Should it just be flat out to there and just let it drift in? Kind of got lifted by the wind, but it should be a putt. Not great, but oh well. Guess who's back? Back again. Thrasher's back. Tell a little friend. Guess okay, who's back. can you hear my audio? Yeah, your audio is Gucci Gang. Gucci, gang. we're ready to watch you rip this. All right. Just remember there is water right in the basket. I'm not throwing that far. Uh, you can very easily throw it that far. You can throw 300 feet. Okay, well. I've seen you rip it. Here we go. Grip and rip. No! Oh, my God. Oh, I kicked off a, a root. All right, Janice, tell the people, uh, what have you been up to since I've been on the road? This is the first year that I've been doing the full tour. Oh, yeah. What's life like at home? Um, calm, quiet, collective. I'm just kidding. Collective? Yeah, things that? are in order. Things are, discs aren't all over my living room. <laughs> nor, what are you talking about? Nor my kitchen. No, it's been, it's been kind of sad, honestly. I miss you, but I know it's your job and we just got a, corgi. another Corgi car. Yeah, we got we... a Corgi car so I could, I could throw the boys in it and we can come see you at a tournament. So I'm excited to do that. Yeah, what's the next tournament you think you're gonna come to? You were How at was... Waco final round. I was at Waco final round and then might do um, Jonesboro. We might drive up to Arkansas Jonesboro. That one's far. What's the closest one other than that? The Kansas one's probably a little bit closer. Oh, then Kansas. Did you go in the water? No. Oh, I just thought you have a freaking bomb arm. Rubber of the sole of my shoe. Were you just carrying that around? It's for wow. the ducks. Rabbit or something's gonna step on that. Okay, what am I throwing here, Jit? Uh, I think everyone wants to see you gap it right there. Bip, bip. With Dark what? Hardcore zone, gapper. Just throw it flat, nastiest gap shot of your life right here. If it goes in the water, will you get it? Oh, uh, yeah. Okay. Gap 5000? Janice! All right, try, try, try the other zone. I think you got this in you. I think you were made for this shot right here. Just forehand, focus, straight to the gap. Money shot, boom. Okay, one more try. Aim left. With what disc? Uh, I don't have another zone. Buzz SS. Just aim left though, because you missed right both times. So just correct in. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, um, you gonna make a putt here or what? Yes, I'm gonna make a putt. But we grabbed my disc from the crick. Yes. I brought it up. That's how I say This creek. is a, a little bit of aggressive of a one meter rule, but it was much needed. And can you hear me yep, now? Yeah, yep, yep. I can't hear you, but it's fine. It's literally blocked by your body or something. What do I do? <laughs> no one knows. These oh mics my suck. Gosh. We didn't realize that this was gonna be a road mic uh, review, but this is a road mic review and they suck. Uh, don't, don't they suck? They're not good. They're not good. They're complicated. They, no, they're not. They're, you're supposed to be, it says 300 feet. Like you're supposed to be able to walk 300 feet away. Maybe you mean 300 like, inches. And like your <laughs> shirt or body is blocked. All right, I don't understand. Physical. Okay. 
We are stretching. We are getting our hammy stretch. That's good. All right. Stretches in. Let's see if he can nail this one. The headwind. Yeet. Oh. Little Ooh. You little rascal. The second one. Freaking rascal flats. Always better. Rascal flats, man. Uh, clearly, guys, it has been a while since we filmed together. Most of these batteries are dying. We're unprepared. Our mic situation is drastically trash. But Janice still makes those pots. Where was that last hole? Glorious. Where was that last hole? Nice putt. Thanks. All right, so Brody just told me that he's going to go up and over these trees. Oh, oh, nice. The pin, do you see it? There's two pins. The close one's over here. And the long one's the par four location over there. And uh, yeah, we're just going to bomb this one over the top. 484, that seems like a rip and a half. Let's go. I mean, if, it do if it's not broke, don't fix it, right? Yeah, try it. Can't wait to follow this one. It's like right there. And down. Good luck trying to follow this one. Yeah, I know. That's exactly what I just said. So this one's being ripped to the moon. Oh, daddy. Oh, daddy. It hit something, so I'm actually okay with it. Okay. So I throw that new disc forehand. See what happens. I'm curious. Okay. See, see how this thing treats you. Okay. This could be really good, or this could be an absolute nightmare. Okay. We found Janice a forehand roller disc. Let's go. I'll take okay. it. Go back to your thrasher. Oh, I'm throwing. I think you threw the other thrasher better. Yeah, I think you threw that one better. Okay. Which other thrasher did I just, what did I throw? I you threw have another one. thrasher in there. You haven't been throwing that one. I haven't? No. You have two thrashers. Oh my. Just in case you lose one, but I think this one's your go-to thrasher. Dang it, that would've been so good. That was smashed. This lines up perfectly for your thrasher. I just got... down the gap, and then there's the basket tucked in right there. Janice is going for the short one. Yeah. Throw this one a little flatter than normal though because the wind's going to take it over to the left for you. Okay. Because it's a right to left wind. So just focus on hitting that gap flat. <gasps> you have a putt. Nice job. You know what happens when people look up Janice in the dictionary? Da-na-na, 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 da-na-na. No. Hear me? I can hear you. Okay. Or are you about to like say something motivational before you jam this? No. Okay. Oh boy. Oh, that looked like it was going in for me. <laughs> Good try. It looked like it. All right, rolled a little bit. So she's got a little bit of a tester left. Something happened. Dang. That sucks. I'm going to say it. You're a little rusty. Well, yeah. It's been like... I think it's been like six months. Broads found his disc. It if only is. I would have made the last one, this would have been back to back. I mean, this is a, this is a really soft par four. Apparently also there's like beavers around here doing stuff around the <laughs> basket. Oh, I was like, what? They have other little Yeah, 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 thing. yeah. yeah. Was, is this the same exact putt? It might be. Wow, Janice, watch out. Okay, a little right to left her. Let her float in. Give it enough chance. I oh. Oh. <laughs> I didn't even, I wasn't even focusing on that. Oh no. <laughs> I was focusing oh, on Oh no. Did it go in the mud? It got close. Oh no. No, it's 
No, it, it is in the mud. Oh, it is in the mud? Yeah, that's it. This is the worst case scenario ooh, right here. Ooh, ooh, I'm backing up. I'm backing up. This is the worst case scenario right here. Mud butt. Big butts. Yuck. You know, this this really good for driving. I might need to find a new putter. <laughs> I'm not Wait. mud putting this. Wow. I'm walking off. What if you don't make it? See, now that's in my head, Janet. Now I'm going to be thinking about that all night. And snake. Oh, you didn't even flinch. No, I didn't. Normally I go zone on this, but I think low ceiling. Yeah, watch and, out for those branches. And with the wind situation. <laughs> the wind situation, I think I'm going to go raptor. Do you, can you even see the basket? You probably can't. See? No. You're, so, you're rusty playing and you're rusty filming. You can't even see the basket yeah, in the first place. I can place. see it perfectly from my angle. Oh. You can throw you can throw through us. If you want to play through. What is I'm, I'm just gonna throw the shot. I'm probably gonna ace it right now. Oh my Make sure gosh. you have a good angle of that basket because this is going in. A little wind out here. It's always a little windy. Oh my gosh. Wind factor is five thousand eight hundred if you can't tell. Yeah, that's pretty much what's happening on our end. What are we having for dinner? Filet mignon. After I fillet this hole. Oh, skip in. Oh, spot, spot, spot. Our second battery is about to die, guys. We are highly struggling. unprepared. And <laughs> not only struggling on the playing surface, struggling on. Man, I'm ashy. What? My skin's dry. I need some lotion. Anybody got some lotion? Are you throwing this across the water? I might. I think you have the, I think you have the arm power. They've also cleared. They Why do we keep grabbing this one? Maybe that's the one you want. No, it's not. I want Paul Grace. Okay. Don't call him. Don't call him. <laughs> Go over the creek. Go over the creek. Go over the creek. It's over the water. It is over the water. I feel like Conor McGregor right now. <laughs> I will say dogwood as wooded as it was. And maybe, yeah, some of the holes could have maybe a couple trees in the middle of the fairway to be taken out. It, coming out and playing back in this wind is absolutely insane. But again, it's good practice because the next couple of courses we're playing are wide out. And, wide out? Wide, wide out. Wide out are wide out in the open. Wide in the open? Wide open. I'm not sure, but there, it's probably gonna be windy. That's what I'm trying to say. Also, Janice completely threw it over this water. Heck My yeah, first I did. First time ever doing it. Heck yeah, I did. Very well done. All right, Janice, after a miraculous shot, has this left for her birdie. She's trying to throw it in with her dark horse zone. Uh, tree there. Is there? You need to miss the tree. I didn't see it. You can't hit trees out here. All right, we are down to our final battery, folks. 65%. We only have another hole to play after this, so we should be good. But my goodness, are we unprepared. The unprofessionalism. Can we be more professional with the throwing? Oh. It's like, you know, I'm getting there, but I'm not. The next hole, I think you're going to make it. Oh, thanks. Why are you filming this? What just happened? Oh, it's really in there. Ouchie. Can you just rip it out? Ooh. Oh, my gosh. That was the largest splinter I've ever seen. That Where'd hurt. you get that? I don't know. Sometimes you just need something to wake you up. And let me tell you, there's nothing that will wake you up more than a three-inch splitter straight in your hand. Look at that. Look at, yep. See, now she's thinking more about the splinter. And, and not, not about the putt. The actual putt. Where's your disc? Huh? Where's yours? I think it's over there. Okay. I'm about to make his putt. Okay. Brody has found his disc. He has found it. Banging chains all day. Do you even bang chains, bro? Do you even bang chains, bro? See, that's all about the disc selection right there. Is I didn't it? have to do anything. It was just the raptor, baby. 
This is like one of the most, oh my gosh, you're calling me? This is definitely one of the hardest holes out in the course. And I never really know what to throw. What do you have in like your hand? Fifth, what? What do you have in your hand? I, I got my X ringer soft. I'm gonna try to throw something nasty. Go Janice, go. Go Janice, go. Go Janice, go Janice, go Janice, go. Oh. Hey, watch out for those branches. That was, <laughs> that was like the nasty line, but I think the, I think the right line is just actually going kind of like a medium over stable putter straight. I think it's a lot easier. And just let it glide down. Like that. Oh. Okay, maybe in this wind, I gotta go Raptor. More speed, get through the gap. Potential. Raptor, Raptor hole. Yeah. There's a Raptor out there. Go in. Oh. You have another Raptor in there? No, but I have something even dirtier. Wait, I want to throw it. Throw what? You want to throw this? Oh, no. You can't control this. Wow. <laughs> this is not going to work. What am I doing? Yeah, let me why, throw. What the heck are I, you doing? Why am I, what am I doing right now? It's too windy, and that's just not going to work. Are you going to throw from up there? I might as well. I'm just kidding. Go, daddy, go. Go, daddy, go. Okay, here we go. This kind of fits the thrasher perfectly, honestly. <laughs> All right, try the other one. And just try throwing it a little flatter. Because that was perfect. It was just a little too much turn. Something in my eye. Are you going to blame something in your eye? Huh? You making excuses? Oh, no. That was oh. a terrible throw. But I did have something in my eye. Okay. Go, daddy, go. A little flatter. Oh my gosh, what the heck was that? Can you go get that for me? Okay, I'll see you guys in 10 minutes. <laughs> you gotta be so gentle on this on this line. You know what you're trying to do here, right? Yeah, curve, curve it, it around the tree to make it come yep. down. Curve it around. Curve it around the bend. Bend like the bullet. Like Pocahontas. Curve the book, what? Like Pocahontas. Yep. Bend the bullet. Um. I don't like that disc. You got rid of my get. You did something with my get freaky party time. Try the thrasher. I don't like that freaking disc. Try the thrasher. All right, the dark horse disc guys uh, might be up for a giveaway soon. Okay, maybe this is how I throw throw from this one. Okay. This is the one I'm gonna take. Okay. My OG shot. What is your? What, are you gonna step out? I think you step out. No, no, no. I think you step out and throw the forehand. Just like a flick of the wrist and just have it try to turn in and bend into the basket nasty. Uh, I was thinking way higher. Oh, like a, like that? Yeah, like tr do it the uh, orange one. Throw it way higher and let it like float to the right. Like try to make it. Like throw it up in the air on hyzer and then let it float to the right. Okay, well, you parked them, so there's that. Okay, let's party. Would this be a birdie? Well, I mean, it was my third shot. Oh. Oh, ho, 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 Jodidi. What the heck? Oh, no. Oh, no. I blame it on the crane fly. Mosquito hawk? Mosquito Oh, this eater. is the last hole. Is that, we can't. Oh man! All right, let me let me just juice this scuba real quick. We haven't we haven't really had like a highlight. I feel like we've just been on a struggle. The highlight is me playing disc golf for the first time. That in is true. Seven that, months. Yeah, I stay corrected. But this could be one heck of a way of closing out a video. What if you don't make it? You know it, what I'm saying? Though? Yeah, but what if you don't make it? Well, like that. No. It will lead. It will lead you guys to come back for more. <laughs> but Janice is back. I appreciate all your guys' support that you've shown over on all my social media channels as well. Yeah, we love you and, guys. And uh, we're doing a 11,000 give or 11,000 member K. giveaway. 11k giveaway. 11k giveaway on the Brody Smith Collector page over on Facebook. Also, that's normally the place that I drop a little 
hints and tease some of the upcoming releases. So the link for that will be in the description down below. And if you're looking to try to pick up some of the discs that we threw or maybe try other brands as well, go over to foundationdiscs.com. Uh, that will have all sorts of stuff for you guys over there. Janice, anything for the people before we go? I'm about to make this putt. Where is it? Oh, there you want to end the video with 10 seconds? Yeah. The 10 foot putt? All yeah. right, end the video with 10 foot putt. This was, this was the highlight that everyone came to see. With the bags in the way. Joe Jizberger, 10 footer. Keep slinging them discs. See you guys in the next one. <laughs>